control it um, with the thing and go back and forth. Or you could use the pre-already um, done movement. That's a waddle. <laughs> He's like, hey, come on, where's those little treats at? And so um, next video, I'm going to do another video next Saturday, and that's going to show, um, I'm going to program it to do some stuff. And so you can program it to do all this stuff. In here. You go in to manage schedule and you can schedule, so add a new schedule, enter subject, add time. You could put how long you want them to play with it. You could do like 15 minutes or 30 minutes. How many treats you want them to have. And um, you could do different schedules. And then their names are in here. So I could do Woo. See, there's Woo. I could schedule hers. See, here's Woo. I put all her information in there. And then um, it says, how do you want it to move for her? Do you want it to move slow, normal, or fast? Do you want the sound to be on? Do you want to add that cat accessory to it? Do you want it to drive normal? Do you do not want it to toss the treats when the pet doesn't follow it? Do you want to play with it in place and it doesn't move? It just stays in one place? Um, all these things you can customize um, the settings for your different pets. So I have Princess in here and I have Target in here. and so. Um, on the next video, I will get Target playing with the um, thing. So if you want to just use it you yourself, you do manual. And then that's where you use the controllers here. I will always do the shake. I like the shake. <laughs> so that's my favorite. All right, so thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope the sound is okay on my GoPro. And um, you guys have a wonderful rest of the day wherever you may be, and these guys are going to take a nap.